Kijio is a new subtitle editor. Compared to most of the other editors, Kijio uses a timeline system for managing your subtitles. You can start up by simply dragging the video and subtitle file into the window. Once the files are loaded, you can see them as red boxes in the timeline. You can easily add new subtitles by right-clicking and dragging. To change the text of a subtitle, all you have to do is click on it and change the current subtitle text value. Editing the subtitle properties is also very simple. You can move the subtitle around by clicking and dragging. To change the display length, click on the subtitle and then click on the left or the right border and drag. You can also fine tune these values in the fine tuning area. You can also delete the subtitles by pressing the delete button on your keyboard. If you want, you can also change their color by clicking on the color boxes in the edit area. You can select multiple subtitles by clicking and dragging over the timeline. You can now edit these subtitles as a group. You can also select all of the subtitles by going to Menu, Subtitles, Select, Select All. This allows you to fix the subtitle offset. Kijio also allows you to change the frames per second rate of the subtitles for a certain ratio without knowing the exact frames per second of the subtitles or the video. You can do that by going to Tools, FPS Correction and changing the value. You can also open a secondary subtitle file which will show at the bottom of the timeline. You can use this as help when translating the subtitles. If you're not good with translation, Kijio also offers an option to auto-translate the subtitles using the Google Translation. The newest addition to Kijio is network editing. This allows you to set up a server and other people can connect to you, thus allowing you to work on the same file simultaneously. You are now ready to create your own subtitles with the Kijio Subtitle Editor. Enjoy!